Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. You're making rice and peas. So I have here two glasses, standard size glass, two glasses of washed rice. You just rinse the rice a couple of times in some water in a bowl and then you soak the rice for about at least 10, 10 minutes. So I have my rice soaking there, two glasses of it. You also need um, a couple, two cups of frozen peas some salt, some fresh zira. Also need uh, one large brown onion or two medium sized onions. So in the pan, slice your onions like this. And add two large tablespoons, this is quite a large spoon of olive oil. Make that three. Three large tablespoons of olive oil. So we've got to darken these onions till they're quite brown and almost burnt but not burnt. When your onions are quite dark brown, you add a quarter of a glass of water, just normal water. And this, you can see the colours have come out now, the brown colour. And this is what's going to colour your rice brown. So once you've done that, we're going to add salt. Add two level teaspoons of salt now. And give that a mix. And you can also add one tablespoon of jeera seeds. It will give a really good flavor to your rice. So now I'm gonna add a cup of tea. Mix it up. For two glasses of rice, we're going to add three glasses of water. One. Now you're going to add your drained rice, so drain the water out of the rice and then just add your rice. And give that a nice mix. And keep it on high heat and we're going to dry out the water now. Okay guys, so here's our rice and peas and as you can see the water is drying up. So we want the water to almost completely dry. So we just carry on until it goes dry. At this stage, when there's still some water left in here, you can taste the salt. So we'll just have a taste of the salt. Take a bit of the water and just taste it. This needs a little bit more salt. half a teaspoon more of salt. Yeah. Right, now it's almost dry. So as you can see, my rice has just dried almost. There's a tiny bit of water left, that's fine. Now we're going to cover it with a damp cloth over the lid and steam it for 10-15 minutes. it with a damp cloth and I put it on low heat. 